Part 7. Mortar Before we dive into the best ways to mix and use mortar for a manufactured stone veneer installation, let's discuss mortar selection. NCMA publishes mortar recommendations by application type. Scratch coat mortar options include site-mixed mortar, meeting requirements of ASTM C270 Type S, pre-blended mortar, meeting requirements of ASTM C1714 Type S, Setting bed mortar options should be selected based on specific application. Start by selecting exterior or interior, then single family or commercial, and lastly, installation height. Type S is okay for most applications. However, for commercial applications extending above 10 feet and cement board applications, a modified mortar is required meeting the requirements of ANSI 118.4 or 118.15. Additionally, stones that exceed one square foot, regardless of their application, must be installed with modified mortar. If the application includes mortar joints, select grout mortar that meets ASTM C270 Type S or N for site mixed mortar. Pre blended mortar must meet requirements of ASTM C1714 Type S or N. Resist the temptation to create your own custom mix for any part of your stone installation. Mortar can be field mixed or purchased pre-bagged. Pre-mixed bulk mortar is available for large projects. Conventional Type S or Type N mortars can be mixed mechanically in a mortar mixer or with a drill in a bucket. Hand mixing can also be done in a mortar tub or wheelbarrow. Follow the mortar manufacturer's instructions, including all ratios for materials and water. Account for weather conditions. Mix mortar thoroughly and to the appropriate consistency for scratch coat mortar, setting bed mortar, or grouting mortar. Retempering mortar is not advised as this will reduce durability and bond strength. Discard mortar that has become too dry. Mortar can be tinted to provide a unique aesthetic. With tight fit installations, tinted mortar can help blend and conceal gaps or small joints between stones. Select a mortar color that matches the primary color in stone. Use any admixtures cautiously. Verify they are acceptable to the mortar manufacturer, job specification, or referenced standards. Some admixtures can create an advanced corrosion risk, efflorescence potential, or negative impact to mortar properties. Modified mortars offer advantage in bond strength, sag resistance, and adjustability but require specific mixing and installation instructions. Be extra careful not to get modified mortar on the surface of the unit, as they are extremely difficult to remove once cured. Thank you for watching. Please view the other videos in this series for additional installation techniques and tips.